Hello friends and welcome. In this segment of the video, I'm going to show you how to create and manage hierarchies in Power BI Desktop. So let's get started off. Now to help the user to navigate through your data, we tend to create different hierarchies in such a way that he can understand the data flow and how to move up and down between them. And that's the only reason we create hierarchy so that we have some order of the data. All right, so how we create this hierarchy. Now, if I move on to the my next slide, it can be seen on the extreme left side of your screen, you will find the fields pane. So in order to create a hierarchy, you simply have to pick one field and drop it onto another. The moment you drop it onto another, a hierarchy will be created right in front of you. Okay, so once you have created your hierarchy after dropping each and every segment, you can make sure that the order of that sequence can also be changed. And how you can change that? You simply have to right click on any of the column and you can ask him to go up or you can ask him to go down as well. So this is how you can manage the position of different columns in your hierarchy as well. So if you move on with this, so now at any time, whenever you would like to create a new presentation or a new projection at that time we can take this entire hierarchy and drop it onto your axis in such a way that the projection that we want to build will be a easier task all right guys so how to create this hierarchy and how to manage this hierarchy we'll be having a better understanding of this in our practical approach Hello friends and welcome. In this video, we are going to learn how to create and manage hierarchies in Power BI. So let's get started and see how it is done. Now in order to do that, first me let me show you a quick table and I will tell you what is the difference by creating hierarchies, how it will help you and by not creating how tedious my work can get apparently. So I'll quickly create a table under the product table. I will take the category column, the manufacturing column, the segment column and the product column all right so out here you can see i have the product the category manufacturing and segment so while creating this table if you have noticed what we have done here is i have manually selected each and every column and dragged it in the visualization sheet that is my report pane right and we have created a table out here now this involves loads of manual work and this is not even in the hierarchy which i want so basically let's say i want it in a hierarchy for first it will be having category then segment then manufacturing and then product right we can get a hierarchy like this so in order to get that hierarchy see what is needed to be done so as of now we will go ahead and delete this visualization and we'll create a hierarchy under the product column itself or the product table itself all right so see how it is done i will simply pick any of the column and drag it under the product ID. See what happens when I drag it under the product ID column. It will automatically create a new hierarchy and name by default it is naming as product ID hierarchy. If I want to change the name of this hierarchy, I simply have to go to this three dots, which can be seen on the extreme right hand side, right? I will simply click on it and this an option which are allows me to rename this hierarchy as of now we will name this as hierarchy one this is the first hierarchy that we have created so I've just name it hierarchy underscore one and I hit enter it gets added out here all right so basically what I want is I want the segment as well out here so I'll simply select this column segment I'm sorry the segment which has column in it and I will simply drag it here Okay, so I have the segment column as well and also I want the manufacturing column to be added in this hierarchy. So I'll simply drag it. Okay, so out here you can see I have all the columns which will be needed for my projection. But I now what I want to do is I want to align them in such a way that it should be in a proper order so i would like to get the category first then the segment then the product and then manufacturer all right so in order to do that i need to simply select this category and drag it upwards so this is how you manually do it so category gets on the top similarly i want segment on top so this time we'll try a different way i will click on this do uh, three dots and i'll ask him to move up all right sorry i have i uh, by mistake i have selected move down that's the reason it has moved from third position to fourth position so i'll simply select this and drag it up 
all right now i have this category segment product and manufacturing in my order all right so this is the order which we which we required all right so we have created a hierarchy now what is the use of hierarchy we will see it in, at the time of we create a projection so let's go ahead and create a projection i will go under the visualization pane and select a stat column chart all right now it's as of now it's empty we need to add some values inside it so i will select this hierarchy and drop it here the moment you drop it here you can see all those category segment product id manufacturer got involved in it in this particular uh, projection automatically and i do not have to do it manually all right so this is how it is useful also we'll be requiring some values out here so i will go under the sales fact and select the revenue and drag it under the value all right the moment you drag in the value you can see my projection is right here in front of me in which i have all the category so revenue by category as it can be seen right so i have the mix all this all these categories the very first one so the moment i drill down on it it will show me segment wise right so how i do that is very simple if you want to select if you want to drill down so in any of the columns you simply have to go to that particular projection let's say for urban i want to drill down and want to know the detail of it so i'll simply right click on it and i will click on this option which drill down right so at the moment i click on drill down see what happens now i'm getting it uh, the cat revenue by category by its segment as you can see first it was category now it is uh, allowing me to get the category along with the segment so i have this different segment all together and what is the revenue for urban that they have generated so as simple as that guys if you want to drill do down more it will add the product id as well so simply right click on any of the column and drill down more so now it is selling me revenue by category segment and product id so this is how the projection looks like now if you want to simply go up you simply have to go drill up so that it goes to the previous projection and drilling up is taking me to the previous projection altogether itself all right so guys this is how you can uh, create and manage hierarchies in power bi all right guys so this was all for this video see you until next time